Hiya, I'm Jasper, and welcome to Video Review for A Time to Kill. It's a movie starring Matthew McConaughey and Samuel Jackson and Sandra Bullock and then some other people, but uh, not so, not as much stars. So, as always, I'm going to give you the good, the bad, and the furry. To start with the furry, nothing significant, maybe some barking dogs. Moving on to the good and the bad. So, uh, essentially, Matthew McConaughey's character is a lawyer who is very poor, uh, we don't know whether or not he's a good lawyer before this really starts, but he's, you know, not not great in the money department. And Samuel Jackson is the father to several kids, one of which is a 10-year-old girl who gets brutally raped and attempted murdered by some just, just the worst people. Two of the worst guys. Like, they establish that they are the worst guys before they even get to them doing the worst thing. So, uh, shockingly... <laughs> Uh, Samuel Jackson murders those motherfuckers and, you know, in a courtroom type of situation. And then basically the rest of the movie is them trying to get him off on an insanity plea. So, um, I don't know. I personally don't necessarily agree that they should have tried to get him off on an insanity plea. Because I don't think it's insane at all to murder those motherfuckers. Uh, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Uh, you know... I, I don't think he should have gotten off for insanity. I think he should have gotten off because that's exactly what should have happened to those guys. <laughs> um, but, yeah, I'm not going to say whether or not that he was found not guilty by reason of insanity or guilty to for murder or whatever else because you'll have to watch the movie to find that out for sure. But, um, you know, acting's great because it has Sandra Bullock, who I think won an Oscar back when they mattered, Matthew McConaughey, who I also think won an Oscar back when they mattered, and Samuel Jackson, who if he hasn't won an Oscar, he's been in everything, and you know how good he is. And this is actually one of his more, uh, you know, down-to-earth subtle roles. Like, he doesn't call somebody, you know, a uh, motherfucker <laughs> in this. So, yeah. Um, the other thing that I like about it is that it showed that the NAACP is basically just race hustlers, and um, it was fun to see at one point in the courtroom scene Matthew McConaughey saying the quiet part out loud. Um, so, yeah. One thing that I will say is that, um, and I'm not going to rewatch this movie, because uh, it wasn't interesting enough, and I, eh, because, uh, yeah. Um, but, did I miss who Mickey Mouse was? I feel like they hinted at it a whole bunch, and I, just, I felt like with how much they hinted at it, there should have been some big reveal. So I don't know how I missed the big reveal, but, yep, let me know if you catch who Mickey Mouse is. Um, so, yeah. But, as you would expect in a case, it's controversial where there's, you know, white assholes who got murdered by a black guy, uh, you know, the public doesn't care about the actual facts of how much of an, you know, just horrible, horrible people, if you want to call them people, those dudes were, uh, but, you know, there's protests on both sides, and there's some racist people involved, and, uh, there's violence a bit, and then there's, like, threats to people involved in the case, and maybe more than that, you know, just exactly what you would expect, and, uh, have probably gotten too much of over the past few years. So, yeah, this movie is a few years older than the past few years, and, uh, I don't know. I don't think it really adds enough to the conversation. It's not like, you know, To Kill a Mockingbird type of, like, revelations and commentary on the human existence. Uh, that It's pretty forgettable. Like, the acting is fine. The acting is great, really, because they've gotten really great actors in there. But in terms of, like, the content, the what it says about man's, inhumanity to man or whatever else like it just it just i don't know it just it seems like a dramatized version of just any case out there that would involve this situation so yeah um i, I don't want to say thumbs down in terms of like acting but thumbs down in terms of like content subject matter uh you know th while they don't actually show the girl at the time uh this is one of those things where you don't have to show her to show the brutality of it and make you really uncomfortable. <laughs> so just be warned if you think they're just going to like skip to like them being assholes and then like day later. Nah, there's enough that you feel uncomfortable and you don't like it. So, um, yeah, that's, uh, that's, that's really all I have for this one. Uh, I don't know that I would recommend it. I don't, just don't, just don't. It's not, it's not bad, but it's not good enough to watch, especially after, you know, however many years this has been. So yeah, that's all I have for this one. Thanks for coming. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you the next one. Bye.